So how does one train to become a clown? Uh, actually, these days it's easier than it's ever been. Uh, there are a lot of formal clown schools. Every state has at least one some sort of clown training. There's over 300 of them nationally now. Um, you can go to professional organizations like the World Clown Association, uh, and they will hook you up with what's known as a clown alley, just like this, in your local area. And those people will take you in and start to train you to be a clown. So. Yeah. And what skills did you discover about yourself that you know that you will become a good clown? Uh, I think when I started, I taught myself to juggle. I can teach somebody else in about 10 minutes, but it took me almost three years. Um, unicycle riding, there's all kinds of things. It's not so much the skill, it's can you be funny doing this skill. So there's a big difference. A lot of um, aerialists and uh, high-skilled circus performers, if they get injured, become clowns because it's a longevity factor. Um, a lot of the clowns that were my teachers were well into their 70s, 80s, 90s. And how important is the audience reaction to your performance? Critical. Critical. It's how I gauge if I'm successful or not. That's right. So, so what do you do? You're able to adjust uh, whatever you have, you have to, to perform in front? Yes. Very flexible. Very flexible. Yeah. That's right. Where do you go from here? Are you going somewhere else? Are they performing? Uh, actually, what they didn't mention today is I also work for the Smithsonian. So I'm going back to New York. I'm going to take off my boots and assume right? my uh, duties at the Cooper Hewitt. Beautiful thing. But yes. nobody re nobody recognizes you when you're no, working. They don't know me. <laughs> In fact, it took me a year to convince them I could help them with this year's festival. <laughs> I kept saying I can help. Really, but do you plan help. to travel somewhere else, like uh, to do this thing? Oh, I travel all over the place. Oh, really? Yeah. Performing? Yeah. And what other countries uh, of the world uh, what did other you go to? Countries yeah. have I been to? Um, South Africa, China, Japan, uh, Haiti. Uh, South America. And you go so, through the circus, like it's a circus uh, company that you go through the circus or some other means. Yeah, there's all different venues. It's not just circus, yes. especially for clowning. You could do carpet clowning, birthday parties. You can do uh, yeah, parades, right. big events, corporate events. There's a whole world out there. Beautiful for making the world happy. We try. Thank you.